Hey, we're Ash and Dan, a couple obsessed with travel and our goal is to visit 100 countries. We've just landed in country 58, Pakistan. This is going to be our most insane adventure yet. Over the next two months, we will be traveling around this beautifully diverse country. From the chaos of Karachi to the majestic mountains of the north and everything in between. We're ready to explore it all. So join us as we soak in the sights, sounds and flavors of this incredible country. We can't wait to show you all that Pakistan has to offer. Pakistan Zindabad. Good morning from Islamabad. It's day one here and we're just on our balcony waiting for our breakfast. So today we don't have too much planned. We're kind of just settling in and we're going to go into Islamabad for the first time. Got a few things to organize, but yeah, it's a beautiful morning here. Um, we were a little bit tired after our journey day yesterday, but hey, what a beautiful mountain view over the city we've got from our apartment. So just ordered our breakfast, excited to get some tea, and I think we're getting paratha too. So yeah really peaceful a lot of greenery around ideal start to our time here what were you up to no oh, before that learning some of the words in urdu nice what have you learned so, shukriya is thank you um yes is jihan jihan no is Nima. Ni nahi. No, I think. Nahi. Yeah. Nahi is no. And as salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. And then you re respond is alaikum. Alaikum or something? Yeah. We're still learning, but. Yeah, we'll figure that out. <coughs> we got our eggs. Mm -hmm. A teapot. We've got two plates each, I don't know why. And the main event. Paratha. Paratha, so nice. What do you think of that? Pakistani breakfast. This looks good. Excited to try the tea. Maybe it's just the same as back home, but I think they love tea here yeah, in I Pakistan. Don't know the difference. We're going to wait to enjoy this. I'll pour your tea. Thank you. Oh, yes. oh yeah. Look at that. It's already milky. Nice. So I think. I love this kind of tea, I think. Let me try it. Cheers, cheers. It's kind of a bit like breakfast tea back home. It's milky. Yeah. Let's tuck in. Yeah, this is good. Time to head out for the first time here. Um, first on the list is actually to get a SIM card. Yeah. But we've just read that it's Kashmir Solidarity Day, so I think it's basically, it says on Google Maps that hours might differ on this day as it's kind of like a celebration or a remembrance actually for the Kashmir fighters. But, um, and then after that, we hope to go to Gina Supermarket for our first market experience. We'll be trying some food and then do it with the most. Yeah. yeah, before I do mosque sunset this evening. Yeah, it's meant to be pretty epic. Yeah, yeah, it's meant to be It's pretty. a clear sky day, so. It's a lovely day. We sat in the sun for a bit after breakfast, which was so nice. We're just going to call a cab to take us into the city. Yeah. 
tomorrow, so we're gonna go there today Later. for sunset. And in the background, there's all the mountains, which is really lovely. I didn't expect Islamabad to be this. Like, I was in calm. Yeah, so far. Really calm. Cool. Um, well, we'll see what it's like when we get to the city centre. You gonna outside? Here we are. Made it. Hopefully, this is the right one. New phone. Yeah, it must be here. So we'll hopefully get a couple of SIM cards. So we will update you once we are done. It's closed, <laughs> so we're off to find another one. But it's because it's Kashmir Day, um, things might be closed, but we're going to try it anyway. Got British Home Stores just here, BHS. All the other kind of stores as we walk along the road. Um, but yeah. So far, it's a very pleasant walk. It's a really nice temperature it's today. So it's so chill. Like, honestly, trees. It's this is lovely. Like, it's a cool city. Really cool city. But well, it feels good to be back in Asia. Asia. I am so happy to be back in Asia. Then both of us. It's Asia is our favourite continent. We've never actually travelled together in Asia, really, have we? No, not really. We've India, only, but we, we did India as a holiday, but this is a bit more. This is yeah, a bit travel different. Travel and adventure. We're on our own as well, so but yeah. This goes on forever. It's yeah. like six <laughs> floors. I did not realise that. A very fancy mall. Well, no SIM cards in this mall, but it's very, yeah, it's a really nice mall, clean, nice shops. So we're actually away to Gina Supermarket now, which is an outdoor market, a bit more traditional, and see if we have any joy there. Stopped here for a chai in the middle of Gina Supermarket, and as Asian markets go, I didn't even know we were here yet. I had to check on Google Maps to know that we were in what's meant to be like, the biggest yeah. market in Islamabad, or the most famous one anyway. But it doesn't feel like we've come into a market, because normally you're used to being like hassled and like... Come into my shop, go yeah, to my shop, none no of that. One, no, no one's even bad an eyelid. The only time it's seemed like we walked into this square and there's like a bunch of cafes, and we've come in and we just came to the first table. Like people want me to go to like this cafe or that yeah. cafe, us to go to this cafe just, or that yeah, cafe. one big shared area, but certainly there's no... Lots of jewellery, lots of couple malls, mm -hmm. some food places, local, just typical market stuff, clothes. Mm -hmm. But yeah, hey, this is not what I expected. <laughs> I like it. This is chill, it's nice. We've ordered chai and they've come. Look at these little pots. This is so cute. I love this. I think terracotta and I think when they're done with them, I don't know if they used them. There was something when we were in India, I remember. They were like, they use this because it's more like environmentally friendly. That as well, maybe just for taste too. Yeah, Tradition. Yeah. Have a little try. So cheers. It's so nice sitting in the sun, is it? <sighs> That's the chai. That is good. It's sweet. It's got like a little spice. I don't know what, like flavour wise. I don't know what it is. We'll need to Google it, but or tell us in the comments what's the flavours of the chai. Because it's like cardamom maybe. It's so much nicer than our tea back home. Oh, yeah. I think. Even though we're famous for tea, it's nicer oh, here. This is way better. I like it. And I like how it's served as well. Yeah, nice finished our time at the market it was almost a little Too underwhelming it was kind of quiet for a market but I certainly wasn't expecting that I was like I thought we went for hustle bustle like there wasn't even that many people there I to know. be honest and there um, wasn't that much food about either no there's like a big bit in the middle which has all the like I guess Red cafes, cafes but nothing too exciting yeah but there ended up being a bit of beef with some of the cafe guys basically when you walk in they try to sell you a table at their yeah, restaurant, they although it's area. all in one area, they've got divided up into smaller yeah, areas. Yeah, tables. I think one table went in the wrong day. It was a little bit largey bargy. Yeah. Like one boy pushed another boy, and it was just like oh, awkward. But we're going to a mall to try and get a SIM card again, and then yeah. we plan to walk to the mosque, which is about half an hour. But it's a nice day, so yeah. good way to see the city too. I just don't know 
die, but I do not expect us to see monkeys. Monkeys on the side of the road? Yeah. I'm hoping to stay there. <laughs> oh, monkeys. They're like the weird ones. Scary. I'm always worried that they just want to come in, jump on you, grab stuff. That is such like a leafy suburb we've just walked through some the houses massive, massive houses. Massive houses. Yeah. We're maybe about ten minutes from the mosque. But we've been trying to find some food that we've not really seen too much. No. But I'm sure we'll find something. But yeah, this lamb bad is not ex as expected. Here's monkey to treat you. Just by me. Fun. just arrived outside Faisal Mosque behind me and this is the main attraction here in Islamabad and you can see why mountains surround it and the architecture is absolutely awesome see it's got four big pillars and it's definitely very lively outside the mosque as well busy and actually feels busier than, than what the market did so we're gonna get a little bit closer to the mosque and Get some photos and basically just take in the surroundings. It's so peaceful. Like we've been, yeah. there's a few people selling professional photos, but I've got Ash, so I don't need that. <laughs> there's a few stalls, but no one, no, no one, one hassles. Hassle, there. You know, everyone's kind of just doing their own thing and enjoying the the area. Um, it's beautiful, like this mosque is stunning, like with all the mountains in the background, what a backdrop. Yeah, it's, it's absolutely beautiful. You can see why it's the most popular thing to come and see in, um, in Islamabad. Definitely rivals the one in Doha we saw. Like the Doha was futuristic. Yeah, this one this seems insane. futuristic, but like still keeping the traditional kind of feel. But certainly with the mountain backdrop, that's what really is stunning. Absolutely beautiful. Let's go see it from a few angles. And yeah. Keep walking about. Dan's new friends. Dan's like a celeb here. So we might only have 600 odd subscribers, but I'm feeling like a celeb just now. I feel like I've got 1 million. <laughs> I've been in a couple of pictures. People are really excited when they say we're from Scotland. Yeah. Wow. They're all they're all one pictures with Dan, though. No one's interested in me. <laughs> <laughs> I know one was Ashley. I don't know. I'm fine with it, though. I'm fine with it. Wow. They ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine. And you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it. Uh, yeah, it, it's good fun. They're really nice people. They're, yeah. It's been such a perfect first day. As first impressions go, this is 10 out of 10, honestly. I'm so excited to explore more of this country. So, so far, so good. Masala fries with ketchup. Masala? <laughs> yeah, yeah, masala and ketchup. Uh, because we've not had anything since breakfast, apart from that chai tea that we had earlier. We've had um, such a busy day, but... We've it's... just not stopped. We thought we'd find food, but yeah, we got a bit sidetracked. These were, I think, a pound. Yeah. Like, total. It was super cheap. But... So we're going to go sit over in the wall and eat them. Yeah. 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 Our first Pakistani street food. Yep. With a beautiful view behind the dam. A beautiful Masala view fries. in this box. Yep. Well, yeah, that as well. The sun sets in like 45 minutes. We've got seasoning. Masala seasoning. And we've got ketchup. Any good? Yeah, 
I wouldn't say there's a, it's like a strong flavour. Um, it's just like a little bit spicy, a little bit tomatoey. This is just a little top up until the sun sets over and then we'll go to actually get some proper food. Yeah, because we need it. But it's between this or sweet corn. We will try the sweet corn one time, we but we want to try the chips. Yeah. And they're good, are they? Street food number two. <laughs> Spicy pop it on. Cheers. How spicy we're talking? No. Nah, just masala kind of. Fine enough. Yeah. 50 rupees, what is that? It's like, yeah. 10 p, 20 p. Um, it's better than any poppadom I've had back home. Really? Yes. It's big it, as well. I don't know if it is a poppadom, but certainly... It's similar. It tastes different. My turn. Oh, thank you. <laughs> that is identical to a crisp we get back home called Skipped. Except it's, it's not plum cocktail flavour. It's <laughs> <laughs> like a spice. Yeah, yeah it's got a spice. spice. It's good though. Love it. 50 rupees well spent. And the sun is getting into position for a lovely skyline. We spent a while enjoying the ever-changing colours against the mosque and watching the reflections dance along the marble floor. It wasn't long before the locals found Dan more photogenic than the sunset. Celeb Dan strikes no again. No pants. <laughs> no pants. 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 No by the end of the day, we were starving, so we hopped into a taxi and headed back to the area that we were staying. This is where we had our first taste of Afghan food. It was delicious. What a perfect first day in Pakistan.